What's up, fellas? Back again. Hey, guess what today is? Today is SMC podcast time. We're going to switch it up a little bit. We're here at Lake Champlain, beautiful lake here behind us. We're doing SMC podcast, lake house edition. We got the boys back there hanging out on the back deck. We're going to see if they know what this is. Oh, yeah. Come on. Let's go inside. Check them out. I What's going on, fellas? Dad, make sure you're good. Right. What's going on? Chilling, man. Chilling and talking and fishing, man. Where you been? I see you. <laughs> I brought this for you. What, you, you want one? Yeah, I want them. <laughs> he, don't, he don't need that. He's got huh? polarized lenses in his eyelids. Did you? That thing right there is the flogger. If everybody it doesn't know what that is, but that's what every, like every I think everybody but you has one I, I in the tournament. One. Yeah, I can't actually. I can't. I can't reach over the side and reach the water. <laughs> it's like my... you look this. You put this on the surface of the water, and you can see the fish down there. But I, I used it, dude. It was. I didn't like it. I, I think it's kind of stupid. Did you try it, Tom? You're always talking about flogging the bishop. Is that? I didn't know it was this. <laughs> yeah, don't Google flogging. You don't want to do that. Don't I was that. wondering how they came up with the name flogger. <laughs> don't Google. <laughs> I gotta Google this is like now. rated don't, X. Do yeah. not Google yeah. flogging. Do not. That's no. Not, no. no. Oh, I think I did actually, and there was these things that you whip people with. <laughs> you whip them. It's a whipper, isn't it? Yeah. Brandon, you know about that stuff, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Rob, I know Rob, you got a dark Rob, side, Rob. He does. Rob's he got a dark side. <laughs> Rob gets those yeah. Come on, Rob. Yeah. What's a flogger? I don't know, man. If you want to use it, you can, because I, I think it's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I Guys, get sick. Yeah. We're here at Lake Champlain, obviously. It's right here behind us. Last tour stop of the year. And we're just hanging out. You know, we've done these podcasts pretty much all year long, and I just wanted to just... Be loose this time. Just hang out. It's a beautiful uh, background. A lot on the line. We brought in Cox. We brought in David Dudley. You got first and second in Angler of the Year right now, which is crazy. I'm sitting way back in fifth, but 33 points or so, I think, something like that. 33, 34 points, something no. like that. So it can obviously be made up, but I'm going to say this. Someone standing on this deck is going to win Angler of the Year. That's what I think. And it's probably not going to be me. So you can figure it out <laughs> between them two cats right there, but... Like the cotton flowing out of a tree, that's sperm. Sperm? Yeah. Tree sperm? Yeah. Tree sperm. <laughs> Same thing with oaks, you know, those little curly. It's yeah. all sperm. The little torpedo, the helicopter things? Sp no, the. you ever seen the brown looking worm? That's sperm dropping down to the, all the acorns below. Do they call it sperm? Yeah. Like if you it's talk to a tree sperm. person and you said, yes. hey, tree Mr. Tree Guy. So all that uh, cotton. Oh, hey, cotton. You got, <laughs> well, you, you're going to be picking sperm <laughs> off your line you tomorrow. On his face. Did you just rub tree sperm <laughs> on your face, Tom? See, here's, here's the seed, right? This is the egg. I don't oh, know. That's Zero. the egg. That would be a sperm. Wow. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Hey, Tom. Yeah. Tom, you got some tree sperm. <laughs> <laughs> I had a feeling uh, I, I basically didn't prep anybody on this one. I was like, you know, we're just going to go hang out and just turn the cameras on. And this is what you get, okay? We're actually trying to have a serious conversation about fishing, and so far we've talked about flogging and tree sperm. Flogging. <laughs> flogging. And just, just to keep it in context, you did get a package that was delivered here, and I did peek inside of it, and it was addressed to... I just... I, do, I can't read that actually out loud. I'll just let everyone read that <laughs> right now. Yes, that I I okay. Yes, and the funniest thing is the UPS guy said that <laughs> like four times. Four times he goes, "Is is it? Yeah, is he here? Yeah, who? Yeah, who? Yeah, who? <laughs> yeah, get him to repeat it. Yeah, <laughs> what you say? <laughs> really on there yeah it's really on there dude Look. no i know yeah, yeah. I know. that's crazy i walked outside and it says john yeah here yeah let's see what's in here i actually peeked in here a little bit there's a t-shirt no yeah, that was the main object of the order he, he sure. needed one more clean yeah, shirt look at this one. furry thing dude what is that hey, thing it was, it was a 3 a.m order man i mean what do you <laughs> it's 3 a.m yeah yeah i don't even know what it is it's some frog with a furry it's a hair jig frog. Yeah, yeah, hair jig yeah. frog. Yeah. You mean yeah, to tell actually, me, John, that bass is going to go, 
if that was like rubber, I would bit it. But because it's rabbit fur, pooh, that's so you think that's what he's gonna I don't say? Know. I, oh there was one God. left. I was like, I got. I mean, oh, oh no, 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 that's better. That's oh, better. better. What about that one? What about that one? Talk to me, David. Talk to me, David. This is what hey. you call. This is the bling bling frog. Got yeah. little, little flashy. This is what you'd see in a bar hopping, dancing. You know something. Yeah, that's the disco frog. Yeah. Um, yeah. Got pierced legs. I reckon you want to call pierced it. Legs. Pierced legs. And got earrings hanging off the back end of a rat. It's even a. What it's do you think rat. he's gonna go up? Go. If you you look like a frog, I'm in the mood for a rat. Nah, I'm nah, gonna go back now. Like he's gonna go. They're picky, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're a mouse. That I need protein from a mouse. <laughs> no, just like you a minute ago when you went and said I'm hungry. What, what do we got? And I said we got some buffalo wild yeah, right. or pizza, and you went pizza. That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was food. Yeah, I saw it. Saw it. it was just. Got it! <laughs> he ain't coming up here looking at whether it's a mouse or a frog. Dang it go. Oh, 3 a.m. order. Like, yeah. This sound like oh, you God. had a little bit of something else going on 3 a.m. Oh my God, I don't even know what else is in here, dude. I'm scared to look. Oh my goodness, you got cameras in there. That's good. He ordered GoPros at yeah. 3 a.m. That's the exciting Oh, there's one. Look, he got the big, he got the big giant well, birthday chugger thing or whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look that way, John. <laughs> yeah. John. He got that one too. Oh, 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 oh. dropped it. Look at that sailboat. That? Why'd you get that one? That's this a... one looks like the one Scott caught him on. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. I got oh, one for everybody. Funny. There that's you Scott go. Is going. All right, got, well, that's about all that's in here. That. You got some drop shot weights. Dude, you got a bunch of drop shot weights. You must I, be I catching had, them drop shot. Yeah, it had nothing with it. Well, there's your one. There's your package back. I'll just we put we it should actually on. all get our tackle warehouse order <laughs> and pull out the That's strangest funny. thing we've ordered. Oh my and God. I promise you, we've all ordered something kind of silly like that rat. Okay. And it, probably the isn't last it crazy time. how like at tournaments that you're not really catching them that great is the tournaments you buy the most stuff. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the tournaments that I mean, it's just crazy. So it's like double whammy because you're probably not you know maybe not even going to get a check in the event. Like mm. you're just like in bad shape. But yet you spend another thousand dollars on tackle, oh, yeah. all this weird <laughs> stuff that you think is going to yeah. work, and then so you don't get a check and you spend extra money, and, it's just and then you don't rack. use anything you bought. Yeah, no. I need to just start doing like when I'm not on them, just be like I'm not filling up, I'm not buying any tackle, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to catch them. I'm just going to just troll motor around just my ramp. float on out there. Yeah, just wait for happens. the event to get over because you know I mean it's just way better that way. Yeah, well, you showed up and you had like two bags, one from Gander Outdoors and one from Dix. Yeah. <laughs> spent like, he's like, I need to just take out all this stuff back. Like, I why don't, I just I buy actually, all I'm going to take most of it back. I went in there and I just bought too much stuff, like weird stuff, mm -hmm. different colors and things. Do you remember yeah. Kentucky Lake when, you, when the 5XD came out? You, you went and bought like a pickup truck full, literally? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like he bought, he went and bought everyone off the shelf up there. Yeah. Yeah, I was like high on 5XDs, man. And then never even threw it in the tournament. No, either. no. <laughs> I, I have them. I've had, I had them so long they all swelled up and ruined. They're all like swollen. Oh my god! From the heat, so it is. It is going to be. This is. I said. Let's get back on the fishing thing because we're actually kind of went way off track there. But we're at Champlain. We we all feel from talking that the bite is a little off compared to what it has been. At least I feel that way. And a few people I've talked to. It's been a little off, and it's really due to high water, uh, a, a later spring, uh, and the winds kind of move some cold water around the lake. So I don't know. What do you think? I mean, is it just? Am I just? Honestly, I'm. I'm probably have the best days I've ever had here. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I've never. Really? Been like this. Yeah. It's been pretty good. But I mean, it's always good though. You really? Know? Yeah. And you just get, you can't tell. Like you don't know. You know, a, a three and a half. You know, three and three quarter fish. I mean, they're all they all look the same. You know? Yeah, it's just you know, hang them on there and the scale them, see how big they are. Oh my gosh! Yeah, so that's scary. So, yeah, yeah, it's like I'm pretty much. I'm one going behind it. <laughs> no, and, no, and like no. I went from hey maybe you know there's Scott, a pretty good shot. Maybe here. he had some scratches on his sunglasses in practice to. <laughs> he's probably got like um, you know. Day one, four pounders. Day two, four oh, pounders. Yeah. Day three, four pounders. Yeah. And then three and three, and three, three and three quarter for fourth day. I'm sure, like. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know, but it's. I mean, this place is. I mean, it's awesome. I mean, everybody's. You know, David's crushed them here plenty of times too. So I mean, it's just. Well, David and I have caught them up there in the north end, up at Missisquoi. 
you know, I'm not going up there, by the way. I don't know if you are. I don't know if you checked it yesterday, but I'm not going to go up there. I caught some fish up there, but they just weren't. I never caught a good one. So, but it was looking like David and I would probably be out there, you know, doing our little back and forth thing, <clears throat> which works out really good because we can kind of block everybody off. So at this point, everybody kind of lets us just have it. Not yesterday. I no. pulled around in there yesterday. I was like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. When I got there, there wasn't a single boat. Shoot. I pulled out there, wasn't a single boat, and I went all the way down it with no pressure. And then and then all the boats started funneling in, and then I left. So it's going to be crazy. Tom, you making the run? Yeah, I've never fished a tournament day here where I haven't got a tie. Really? <laughs> I practiced up here one day, and it's uh, it's weird down there. They, I mean, they had so much rain, all that high water, it's pulled through. And then they had like a three inch rain last week, so it dumps in, comes from the south, goes to the north. And it, it's muddier. I mean, it's, it's muddy. The weeds kind of lay back a bit. I think it's I think it's starting to settle out a little bit. I think it's getting better. That first day of practice was not good, but it's not it's not the usual tie where you definitely have to go down there and grind. The problem is you lose half your day running down and back. So. Yeah. Well, it's, it's not supposed to be a bad wind, so I think it'll be okay. Yeah. And it's, the thing is, though, it's like if you judge this anywhere else, it's kind of like asking your kid, like after Christmas, yeah. hey, well, how was Christmas? Oh, it's kind of a bummer, you know. I didn't really get anything that great. Really? Yeah, I just got like four pairs of Nikes, a three video game. Uh, you know, I got uh, this. this <laughs> video, I got a couple of Adidas. So yeah, so, I got a new shotgun. Got a new fishing pole. I got a new TV. You know, it's just not that great. And, and that's kind of like what it is here. It's like, oh, you're, you're just fishing a little tougher. It's like, yeah. you know, if you have to go like 15 minutes between bites yeah. or something. It's like this place sucks. Yeah. So yeah, it's definitely down. Mm. We're so jaded when you come up here. You remember your best day ever. And it's like, yeah. right. I want to catch 100 day, and everyone's right. over three. And see, I'm the opposite. I've never gone to tie in a tournament day ever. I used to go down there when we had unlimited practice. We'd come here and you know, had four days. We had four days at one point, and then we had unlimited. I'd come here, and I would go down there one day to not catch them. <laughs> like literally, I went down there, put the boat in the water, and I was like, "All right, I'm gonna go run stuff." And I do actually do not want to catch anything. And about halfway through the day, I hadn't caught anything because I didn't want to catch them. And it's like I'm fishing stupid, and yeah. and I'd go, "Yeah, this place is terrible." Put it back on the trailer and come back, and then never think about it again. But it would just get it out of my system. Right. That's smart. Actually. Yeah, I just would just get it out of my. That way, if you're killing them down there, I don't care because I can't catch crap. I ain't going no matter what. I'm just gonna stay up here. That was the well, way I would eliminate. It's really time. not that like <clears throat> everybody talks about that long run. But if you go to the north end here, yeah, in 45 minutes, like you're only yeah. looking 15 minute different. Right. And it's like, well, I ain't making that long run. Where are you going? I'm going right. up north. You well, know, you used to launch out of here though, up here. Yeah. You used to launch at Monty or whatever. This yeah. right here somewhere. And so that's another 10 miles. But by the so time you bit. go through this, this slow way, go through the gut, go through here, go through that, and take off. And the only good thing is, is it's, you know, mildly, like, protected yeah, going up. Yeah, right. And that I'll is, and that is that. The But time-wise, yeah. yeah. you're time looking wise, the yeah. same. You're yeah. going, yeah. it's 45 minutes until you set it down. Yeah. And I'm like, it's almost the same as going to tie. Can you flog down there? It's <laughs> <laughs> only after he's done fishing. <laughs> I'll tell you a funny story about the original the original flogging situation started back in. Uh, I won the tournament that year, so it was the second time I won. So it must have been like 2006. And Kevin Long, remember Kevin Long? He used to fish. Kevin Long and Laura, his wife, would travel with him. And I'm down mid lake, and I had already found these fish out in about nine foot of water, and they're on this dark bottom spot, so it was real hard to see them. And I was just running back through there to check them. So I started to stop short. I was trolling motor up this bank. You have to go around this little corner. And so I'm trolling motor and I'm looking and I go around this little corner and I look up and there's Kevin Long and Laura and she's literally holding his feet and he's leaning over with a snorkel and a mask on and she's trolling motoring around holding him. He's leaning over with his head and everything underwater. <laughs> and I'm like, what are you doing? He comes up, you know, he's laughing. I'm like, dude, can you really see? Oh, he goes, oh, I see everything. I'm laughing. I'm like, that's so ingenious, but crazy. I can't believe it. And the whole time I'm going, he's right on where these fish are. So I'm thinking, he found them. I mean, no right. doubt. So I don't say nothing. I leave. He keeps on doing his little original flogging thing, hanging over the boat. And uh, so I didn't go there day one or day two, thinking the whole time that, you know, they're going to be gone. So I go there on day three, roll up there, and I'm like, well, let me just see. I'm like, oh, dude, there's that one, and there's that one, and there's that. They're all there. So he didn't see them somehow. And he it was like halfway in the water, dude, under what she's hanging on to, throwing around. Yeah. See, I, I'm kind of disappointed in you. Like, 
you know, you were talking about like using your remote and looking. Like, I, why didn't you hang halfway in the water with a snorkel and run your troll motor? So I, I just use that little remote and like I'm playing a video game. So I hold it over the side and I'm ye, 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 just looking around and trolling like that. See, I, I had to use did you crash into anything yet? Hit me in the Not face. Out of the did, you did you crash into like a, a mooring buoy man. or another boat? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> No, I looked up. On another I had to look up a few <laughs> times in the mountains. And the Rondex Mountains were spinning around my head like, I'm like, oh. You got yeah. dizzy? Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. And then, did you, you you can see so deep with it, you're just driving around looking. I pop up, look, my 25 foot. I'm like, I ain't seeing one that deep. I was wondering what you were doing out yeah. there, dude. Yeah. I'm still I looking saw him at way the bottom of a bay, and then no. five minutes later, he was up on the bank, dude. <laughs> He was like 10 feet no. off the bank. I, I was like, he's, he's walking Scott, Scott everywhere. Said, Dudley is flogging in three foot of water. What is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> he can see the bottom. Yeah. Stand I was up. just like, stand up. You didn't hear me yelling, stand up. Put your glasses on. I don't and think you really need the flogger in three foot. He was all over the place, dude. That's funny. He's like, I can see the bottom I so good right here. here. I turned around and you wouldn't see him because you can't see him. I was started down seeing down lake and trout like, down there. What's, going going here? Here? what's that giant fish? Oh, what's that? What's that? What's that underwater sea monster that's supposed oh, to be champ. in here? Yeah, champ. Champ. Yeah, I, almost, I thought I got a glimpse of champ oh out there gosh. one time. Brandon McMillan said he has a, a picture on his phone of some skeleton something he found on Big the bottom. Big dinosaur or something. Stop. For real. Really? Yeah, he has yeah. a picture of it. Yeah. yeah. Come on. They need to go yeah. find it. They think it's probably like a moose or something, but it's a full skeleton. He said you can see it with your eyes, not with, you don't need the really? fogger. Yeah, you can just see it, like plain as day. A moose? Yeah, Is like, there any mooses here? I don't know. That's just what you, they said they thought it yeah. was. Or an elk or something. I don't know. Yeah. Is moose plural? Mooses. mooses. Do you mooses. say mooses? Do we say gooses? How do you say mooses? multiple moose? Meese. 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 <laughs> It's a bunch of moose out there. Tom knows all these things. Is it? It's just moose. It's just moose. All the time. <laughs> it's just <laughs> moose. It's just moose. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh wow. That's funny. What else has been going on in the world? Anything else that we can talk about? <laughs> uh, well, there's Mike Long. Has anybody heard about that? I heard about it. That's pretty crazy, huh? That is real crazy. So, who? What happened? Mike Long is a guy that's the big bass catching guy out in California, and I heard yeah. about it on the internet. And I, I, I don't have an opinion really. I don't know anything about all this, so I'm just I don't think any of that this video dude, was right? pretty crazy but, though. I guess he was. I haven't got to see the video. Yeah. I'm glad he's not in this tournament though. <laughs> I'll say that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, I heard that there was some situations going on with like. A treble hook and catching well, I mean, these big I, fish. Without Not in a saying tournament, anything, obviously. Yeah, just he, like so, so, fun fishing or so something. So pretty much the allegation is is like he's snagging fish just like I off the bed. Hold on, hold on. What are you doing? You're going. Hello. <laughs> you're going? Hey, I'm, like, I'm thinking y'all just talking. I'm like, yeah, dude. <laughs> no, we're rolling with it, dude. <laughs> I, I was right up was like, we're missing right? somebody. I, I thought the whole I, time, I'm like, we're missing somebody. I went to go eat. I was starving, dude. What'd you eat? Texas Roadhouse. Really? Oh, it's good. Yeah. By yourself? Yeah. You must know you're going to get back. a 10 grand check going to Texas Roadhouse. Like, if, Damn, I wasn't doing, if I wasn't going to, if I wasn't doing good in the tournament, I'd be like, Dot, McDonald's dollar menu Dude, or something. It, Man, my We're coming home with at least 30 this week. Uh oh. Man. Is that a check? I don't know. I don't think so. Is it? <laughs> check, check's not 30. You it's like 100, 15, yeah. 12, yeah. 10. Yeah. And then was it nine thousand six four? Yeah, I don't even think that's a check. Mm -hmm. So we're talking about Mike Long. We just brought it up. We're talking about crazy stories about yeah. the, the, what's going on on the internet. They were so yeah, catches. I mean, there's just a lot of allegations of him snagging fish. And there's always been like you can look back on some of the the history of Mike Long, and there's always been like people chattering about it. But you know, there's always those people like yeah. spreading rumors saying, "Oh, so and so cheated this," you know, whatever. <laughs> but uh, some guy. But I don't like, think he's done it in turn. I didn't say no, this. No, there's no allegations of him doing it in tournaments. Yeah. And, and again, I, I don't know Mike Long. I know of him, and I, and I'm you know I don't have an opinion either way. If it had been in a tournament situation, it'd be a whole different conversation. But he's done it and posted on Instagram and stuff. But I, the only issue I have is just snagging the fish is not healthy for the fish. No, and not then at all. deceiving, obviously, 
you know, the, the fan base would like, oh, I caught yeah, this on that's a bad. such and such jig yeah, whenever you, yeah, you know, just, it's not cool. It's just so, bad. It's just all whatever. Online. I don't know. Sorry, he was Mike. catching I, I some even... megas, though. I mean, well, I saw one that he that jumped, and I was oh. like, I'd snag that kick. <laughs> I mean, I mean, let's be honest. I would just, that I probably would have snagged that fish, too, but That's I wouldn't put it on Instagram money. saying I caught it on a Guggen trench hog. I would say I snagged the thing, okay? <laughs> I saw and it that weighed 21 pounds. I, that I just want to put my hand. I just want to snag one, okay? I'm just saying. <laughs> I mean, this thing jumped out of the water, dude. It looked like a baby seal. Oh, it was it did. It was incredible. Oh, it's giant, bro. It's like one of them 18 pounders. Yeah. And he, I guess he couldn't get it to bite, so he was like. <laughs> 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 oh Enough God. of that. I know that was a little yeah. controversial, but but it is what's going on in the world. That is. Yeah. A thing. It is a thing. So are you going south? Well, Tom's going south. I'm staying up this way. You're staying up. Yeah, I'm gonna stay right here. I had a little hesitation in there. He did? Yeah, well, because I don't really know what I'm going to do. What? You, you might know? go south? He, in other words, might, you don't want to let me, yeah. like, like, we're down behind south, like, him. Uh, and he don't want to it. Well, not all the way down the tide, but pretty far down there. Large mouth or small mouth? Both. Oof. What? Oof. 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 What? Oof. I don't know. I, I don't really don't know what I'm going to do yet. In other words, we're not going to get a straight answer. <laughs> yeah, I know. Just, yeah. just say it. You don't want to say it. <laughs> Yeah. I think you picked the right of the lake. I know. I, I really don't know. He, he don't want to give up. I think you picked the right of the lake. I just don't know. I haven't seen any of you guys all week. So. I know. That's I thought, part I thought of the we were I haven't seen anybody. Yeah. I haven't seen anybody at all. No, you picked the right end, dude, because this thing got jacked up. So I'm, I'm going to stay up here in the jacked up stuff and do what I can. You're staying up here, I'm sure, somewhere. I ain't going to tie. Uh-uh. There ain't no way. I'm staying. You running south? I'm going south. Okay. We got two south. I've never, been, I've never fished there in a tournament. Before. Three no south? No, we got three south. South versus north right here. Yeah. Because John's going to probably be from here south, I'm assuming. Or around here. We can put him in the south club? I don't know. Yeah. We'll put him in the south club. So it's north versus south. Yeah. Okay, we'll have to south. see who wins on this deal. He's jacked on Mystico okay. on your ridge and just doesn't want to see it. <laughs> he's, like, he's like, I can't yeah. believe I, I watched that thing. I was like, man, I've caught nothing but pickerel out there. What the yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got so many pickerel out there. I've caught a lot of pickerel. Yeah. Yeah. That's for sure. yeah. All right, so it's time for dinner. It's time to wrap this thing up. Thanks for hanging out with us here on the little. Is my butt plant. wet? Yeah, it's wet, dude. <laughs> 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 that could be tree smoke. I still feel a little cold back there. I was like, did I, did, I <laughs> did, did, did I pee? Did I pee? Did I pee? I think I peed. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out, guys. And we will see you later. Boom!